Good morning guys, welcome to a new vlog. Today I am going to Cycle Bar and I have no other plans today, which is uh, kind of nice because whenever I have like a weekend on with like doing a lot of things, I always need like a weekend of like chillness, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but I did get a couple new things that I'm gonna show you guys in this video because I'm so excited. So I got the Brewmate. Um, I posted like a short, like a YouTube short and a TikTok about it that I'll show you guys when I'm not driving. And then I want to unbag a new like aloe bag. I actually ended up getting it on eBay, but it's like new with tags um, because I didn't realize that they stopped making the big tie-dye tote. And I'd always wanted that. I'm like, I kept pushing it off saying like, oh, I'll get it like later. I don't really need that. Um, but like, I really wanted it. So when I went to the website to look, they didn't have it anymore. I'm like, did they discontinue this bag? I was like, kind of just on the fence about getting it. I don't know. So I had to get the bag secondhand, but it's still like new, if you know what I mean. So it was under, I think it was under $50. Like it was $47, which wasn't bad either because I was hoping I'd get like a deal on it since they're like kind of a dime a dozen but I'd always wanted one. This is so random, but I also wanted to chat about the bar sweatshirt. So I had gotten one, but I put the wrong address. So I emailed them and everything, but then I think somehow, like one of the apps, my order got canceled. So I don't know if I'm gonna get the bar sweatshirt or not, probably not which is kind of sad. But then I saw this TikTok of someone saying that the bar sweatshirt isn't even that like good a quality and that makes me so sad because like I love Bridget and like I love her brand but obviously I can't afford that so I mean I like it and I want to support her but I just like monetarily cannot do that the sweatshirt I could afford so it makes me sad that it's not like that good a quality so I'm thinking that I might go to eBay to look for one I'm sure that they have like sizes that people didn't like the size or something they're trying to sell so I'm gonna be on the hunt for that so yeah we'll see I don't know but that's it for my rambles this morning I'm almost late to this class because traffic was so so bad it's like starts in four minutes and I'm just now like turning onto the road where cycle bar is but it's fine as long as I'm there like within the first song like it'll be fine oh my gosh there's a lady now next to me this is awkward but even though I had to park in the parking garage I'm parked in front of like a window so good lighting um I want to show you guys my brewmate okay this thing is so cool but there's already like one thing I don't like about it and it's like it takes more effort to suck out of the straw uh, because the straw comes in like three pieces like this is a piece I'll just show you guys so if you turn the little knob this is like the little thing you can when it's in the middle you can take it completely off like this is its own piece and then this lid is its own piece this lid comes off and then the straw comes off so well, inside I have water but basically this straw comes off like this it's actually kind of difficult but anyway so the straw is in two pieces so it takes more effort to like take a sip of water like I'm not gonna lie I know it's first world problems and I overall really like this cup it's just like the Stanley it's just so easy to just like sip on your water or whatever drink you have in it but this it takes a little bit more effort there's some sort of magnet because it like it's a magnetic closure and then you turn the lid this little knob like I showed earlier to lock it or to open it so the ridge if it's like all lined up it's open and you can drink your water and then when it's in this little indent right here I don't know if you can see that but it's closed so literally like no spillage nothing which honestly I think is really neat and I know that there's other water bottles and cups that do the same thing, but I'm still amazed and I think it's cool, but I don't know. I'm going to give it like some time. I know for work, I'm probably going to keep using my Stanley because I don't want to like have to fight drinking water because I don't have that much time. Like I just want to like sip and go, you know, not that this takes a long time, but 
I don't know, it's like I have to exert more energy to take a drink of water. That's the best way I can explain it. Okay, so I don't know what has like come over me. I keep seeing people with this jacket, but it's the cropped version and it doesn't have a hood. See, this one has a hood and originally, I never really wanted this one to begin with. I ordered the wrong thing. This was back in 2020 when I was literally like spending a lot of money because I wasn't doing anything or going anywhere. And I don't know what happened to my hair glue. I didn't have like anywhere to go or do because of like COVID, you know? So I basically just like online shopped. It was so bad. Um, but I still was working too. So I didn't like lose my job or anything. Thank goodness. So I like obviously shopped and i ordered this but it was like the wrong thing so i'm wanting to go to lululemon because i checked on the app and they do well it says that they have it in stock so i'm gonna go kind of try it on i'm gonna get starbucks too when i'm down there i wasn't really expecting this but my friend last time i was in winter park she got this jacket because she was like it's a sign and i'm like you know what it is a sign you need to get it and then like i now i've seen it everywhere and I'm like now i want it and I'm thinking about, I might sell this one. Um, I still have another jacket on eBay that I'm trying to sell, but um, this one's gonna go for like probably really cheap. Like I'm probably gonna post it for like $30 because it's been worn hardcore. This is my oldest Lululemon jacket or probably, well, no, I had leggings, but this is like the second oldest Lululemon thing I've had. So it has a lot of wear and tear on it. Nothing's damaged about it, but it's just definitely been, you know, heavily used. So I am probably going to try to sell it, but at like a dirt cheap cost, like 30, $25. So I can like get something for it because kind of like the rule I go by, like if I'm going to get something, something has to go because like, why would you have like so many of something? I don't know, it's just my way of thinking. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm trying this like ponytail thing because I don't know, my hair is just, it's not doing a good job. I think that's okay. It doesn't look bad. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go try on that jacket and get some Starbucks in Winter Park, cause why not? This is the great thing about having a workout class in Winter Park. You can just come here and have a Lululemon I swear, I think Celebration needs to get a Lululemon in town. <laughs> Something like Park Ave with all these shops, that would be great. Um, but also too, I'm gonna see if they'll take my um, my healthcare worker discount and just show them a picture. I don't know if that'll work or not, um, but we'll see, fingers crossed. Okay, found these pants. They go with the um, scuba zip, the full zip I got. So I think I'm gonna get these. They're so cute. Okay, and the jacket I'm totally getting because it's so cute and it almost looks like it's meant for me because I have such a short torso. So, yes. Oh my gosh, I love it. These two things I'm definitely getting. That, I might wanna try in a bigger size because it was a little tight. <laughs> it was like tight here, but like fit around my like waist here. So it was like a weird fit. Okay, so they did honor the discount, but they needed me to put like my stuff to get verified. Um, note to self, just gonna go to the Disney Springs one because they always just do it without me having to like show them anything. But I did apply for the verification, but they only like had um, nurse or doctor as like the option for a healthcare worker. So I'm over here like, mm, well, I'll try, whatever. So yeah. Fingers crossed it gets approved, I'll let you know. Okay, so update, cause they just like emailed me back. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get verified or whatever, that's weird, but whatever, it's fine. I'm just gonna know to always just go to the Disney Springs one to get that honored because they always do it. That kind of sucks. I haven't tried at Millennium Mall, so we'll see if I ever like shop there, but just snowing Winter Park doesn't do it. Okay, so I ended up getting the jacket and the pants, which is crazy and it kind of sucks that I can't apply for like the discount thing because it's only for doctors and nurses, so kind of sucks. Um, but again, I'll just go to the Disney Springs one. So we have the pants. I absolutely love these. They're so cute. And I... I don't have any sweatpants if I'm being honest like I don't own a pair like I don't own black booties either which I really need to get some because I wore mine like until I could feel literally the ground beneath my feet which is like weird 
but I didn't have that and then I did go ahead and get the jacket because I had my size and I just wanted it so I got it I don't know it was payday so I'm happy and the best noise there is my coffee I'm gonna head home now and I know Valerie's cooking dinner like she's grilling out steaks so that's gonna be super good super fun I always love it when she cooks always such a treat so i'm trying to make this little like clip for tiktok and instagram but it was taking forever and i didn't get my wording the way i wanted it and i didn't like the framing either so now we've got this going on so hard man so hard okay so i want to show you guys real quick the aloe bag i ordered from ebay oh so i thought this was the aloe bag okay no, it's the pajamas. All right, it's the pajamas I ordered for the Galentines. Yeah, it's like super late. I'm definitely going to return these. So that was super anticlimactic. Okay, let's try this again. I just got the notification that the aloe bag came. I might as well just keep these because I already have them. And in case I get invited to like another Galentines party next year, they're good to have. But let's open this on up. I hope it's cute and I hope it's like bigger. I mean, it's kind of like in this small thing. Ooh, okay. Oh, it's just folded. Well, I mean, I kind of knew it was folded. Ooh, this is actually kind of cute. And the tags are on it. Ooh, this is so cute. It's perfect for the beach. And with like spring and summer coming up, I'm really excited to use this. I might use it as a work bag too, eventually, but okay. It's so giant. You could probably fit like, this is like the perfect beach bag. I'm very happy with this. And then as you can see too, like it does have the um, tag on it still. So I just wanted one that was like newer. Like I didn't want it like heavily used. It's recording now. Okay. Hello. Tell everybody what you're making. I'm making filet mignon. I'm making potatoes and butter with sour cream. Mm -hmm. And I'm making broccoli with hollandaise. Sherry's on I'm potato on potatoes, duty. <laughs> We're going to start calling you Sherry's potatoes. I know, right? When are we going to pop up with that wine? I don't know. Oh, Whenever Sherry. you want, what? I guess, Sherry. Well, I don't have it. It's not ready yet. Well, it's not ready. It's in the process. No, I mean, I've, I've got to put, I mean, they're in the pots that they came in, but I have to put the dirt potting soil. But we've got um, parsley, we got garlic chives, oregano, and peppermint. Yep. And the steaks are on? Yes, no. Not yet. Not yet. No, nope, still cleaning the grill. Yeah. Sherry and I are out here enjoying the lanai with doggy. Oh, 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 gosh, this is not your dinner. <laughs> That's so funny. No, no. Sherry and I have been splitting our glass of wine, and here is dinner. Look how beautiful. This is Sherry's, and the broccoli is actually over there. It's going to be served shortly. The next day. Valerie, what yes. are we doing? We're going to the gym. Short commute. <laughs> Piper and I are on our way to go donate some clothes and stuff to Embrace Celebration because um, one of the Rotary Club members, I'm a part of this thing called Rotary, so one of the members is like, oh, they're collecting things, and then I think they're going to go to brunch, but I don't think I'm going to go because I need to, <laughs> mothers want Starbucks, so I'm just going to go get us some Starbucks and head home, but I will like... I have a lot of stuff to donate, so I definitely want to give back and everything. So that's what I'm doing now, and Piper really wanted to come. We haven't had an outing in a bit, so she and I are on our way to run errands so I can drop that stuff off and go to Starbucks. Hi, welcome. 
I swear it's always a production taking this girl because there's just so much to carry in general and then dealing with a dog it's hard but it was worth it got everything organized got a bag got the cup holder so i could carry things in um but yeah we got the family's order it's that time again it's girl scout cookies time so i know i like sherry so i know sherry likes these the thin mints and then the caramel delight and then valerie likes these but i do like them too so she's gonna get more and then the peppermint butter patties. I love those. The peanut butter patties. Oh my gosh, so good, so good. 